so now I can get past that one dog. You know what's really funny is one time I found the password for this place right in one of these trash cans, right outside the building. So he was like, what's the password? And I was like, I don't know. Then I dig in the trash can. Oh, here it is. Ha ha ha. Every time an animal hits you, you lose life. Eventually you'll die. I have three lives. Those three little Hollywood things at the top, that's my men. This game is really insistent on giving me a crap load of crowbars. I didn't choose the thug life. The thug life chose me. Alright, let's see what we got here. Can you help me? Yes, try searching this building. You notice how I pull out my fists before I try to talk to anyone? <laughs> I don't have to do that. I can talk to him with anything equipped. I just feel more comfortable ready to punch someone. I like how everyone is completely content with me breaking and entering. And I just died. Cats are the most friendly animal in this game. They sit still, and they only attack you if you approach them. Whereas dogs run by, but see how the cat just stands there? That's awesome. I won't be killed by that cat. If I approach the cat, he'll stand up. That's your warning. If you get any closer, he will jump and take off. But that is relatively harmless compared to a dog. Perhaps that is where my hatred of dogs originated from. How stereotypical does it get? There was cheese in the mouse hole. Can you help me? Yes, this building is empty. Sweet. I'll get caught by them just so you can see the jokes. Let's see. Why did the toon throw his watch out the window? He wanted to see time fly. Ha 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 ha! Saved again by my witty sense of humor. Thirteen, this is a bad luck number. I can't believe I just got hit by a cat. I do believe I just got the password. Yeah, I got the password to the Ink and Paint Club. So I think I'll go check that out next. Where the hell is my fist in this pocket? Digging through all the shit in my pocket, I can't find my fist! Ah, oh, there it is. Alright. Can you help me? I always consider this a parking spot, just because it's like perfectly grooved like a parking spot, and no other car will hit you while you're here, if I remember right. Well, except the weasels, they'll totally hit me, watch. But that car didn't, see? He went right by. Alright, weasels, where are you? It's not that hard, I'm parked. Wow, they lost me. The weasels lost me while I was sitting still. They really are incompetent. Me in. What's up?
What's the password? Walt sent me. Okay, come in. So this is the Ink and Paint Club. If I remember right, if I talk to this table here, hey, you get a phone number. I've never called that number, but I've heard rumors that if you call that number, you'll get some sort of promotional hotline that was out when this movie came out. Obviously now I would expect that number to do nothing. But if you want the number again, you just talk to him again. Yeah. And if I remember right, there's never anything else in this club. It's empty. If you talk to Jessica, can you help me find my phone number and give me a call? See, I found the phone number. So if I call back in 1980-something, or 90-something, I might have been okay. If you have a rose, you can give it to her, and she'll jump off the stage and tell you where a piece of the will is. I don't have any roses, so I can't do that. Let's continue the search. Alright, something in this building. Every time you find out there's something in the building, you always want to start outside. By the way, how is the stream quality? I hope the stream quality is good for you guys. I'm not really sure what to set it to on this thing. I hate rats. They cause a lot of damage. Well that sucks, I got a piece of meat. I hope that wasn't all. Anytime you find something, you go back in and find out if that was all. Can you help me? Yes, now the whole damn hotel is empty. You'll notice that the bigger the building is, the bigger the interior is to search. Ah, what the hell, I'll let him tell a joke. Come on. Come on. Alright, hurry up. Alright, what do you get? Why do you want to work in a bank? Well, I'm told there's money in it. Ha 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 ha. I'm so witty. Alright. Now what's really cool about this game is when you go to the other places like Toontown. That's cool. Another hotel. Can you help me? Yes, try searching. Oh my god, there's a bomb in the hallway. Bomb. You're welcome, everyone. I just saved your lives. Yes, oh, keep searching. There's more. Okay, well, let's start outside. I mean, everyone's totally calm that there was a bomb in the hallway. And not just any bomb, it was the most stereotypical cartoon bomb. Come on, you stupid mouse. See, this is why I hate the mouse. You have to wait on him to go the correct way. Alright, come on. Come at me. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. Not from that way. Come on. Come from over there. Thank you. Search quickly. Dig in the garbage. Don't judge me. The fishbone, which I just got, will protect you from deadly cats. Hello? Can you help me? Yes, oh my god, try searching. There's still more. Let's search the rest of the garbage. Yes, the birds will try to shit on you. And there's nothing you can do about it. That's why I'm waiting on the next bird to fly by, so you can take his shit. And totally fail to search the garbage. I like how that lady is watching me dig in the garbage. Also, not everyone outside the building will be helpful, like this. 
Can you help me? Oh, wow, she's helpful. Of course. Thanks for proving my point. I'm trying to show how people aren't helpful, and you're totally helpful. Alright, how about you? Can you help me? No, I'm afraid I can't. Oh, yeah? Now can you help me? Go away, you horrid man. You deserve that. Alright, well, the entire outside has been searched, so now we're going in. Hey, it's a rose. Now I can find out where a piece of the will is. Can you help me? Yes, this building is finally empty. Good. This building is another store, but it's locked, so you have to break into the store. Break into the store so that you can buy things. I want that rose. You know that guy's gotta be like, how the hell did you get in here? Oh, I broke the lock. Thanks for the rose. Let me pull out my fist. <laughs> Alright, let's see, what do we got? Always check the outside of buildings, like stores. Sometimes you find stuff. Not this time. Why are false teeth like stars? They come out at night. Ha 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 ha. I cut that kind of close. I had one second left. If you run out of time, they kill Roger. So, and you lose a man. So, you do not want to run out of time. I need more wallets. Pain in the ass. Ugh. I hate dogs. <laughs> Crowbars, yeah. I need a lot of those. <laughs> Ah, where's my fist? In my pocket. I need more wallets now. Go back to my house and load up on all the wallets I probably stole. Ah, uh, two wallets. <gasps> oh my god, that was close. Two more wallets. Two more wallets. Two more wallets. Alright. Let us continue the search. Oh, ran out of gas. I'll let him push me. Why is a river rich? Because it has two banks. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Yes, try searching in another building. Or, try searching this building. Alright. Always start with the outside. Oh, thank god there's a cat. Mmm, meat in the garbage can. That's awesome. Alright, let's see if that's all. Can you help me? Yes, this building is empty. We threw out our meat. If I get run over, I die. If Roger gets run over, he just gets back up. He's a tune. It's kind of nice. <laughs> 